Good luck, have fun! Hey guys, Epidemic here, and while I was playing some Dead by Daylight as chill as could be, I have encountered what I think may be the Karen of Dead by Daylight Twitch. I'm pretty sure that's the killer. Great. Great dude. And here we witness a wild lizard seagull already causing problems for herself as she assumes the person who typed in their chat, good luck, have fun, is the killer. Some delicious haunted grounds with our lethal pursuer. On Shelter Woods, which is uh, the most killer-sided map. That is a bold fucking statement. Cool, there he goes. Mr. Rage Quarter himself, easy report. Console Club, what a fitting name. It's almost like rage quitting isn't really reportable. You'd think with 10,000 hours on this game you'd understand that, but apparently she doesn't. Why are you typing in my chat while playing the fucking video game? Oh my god, dude. I can't. Bro. Imagine. Imagine. Why are you here? Why are you typing in my chat? I just... I love how she thinks the person typing in her chat is the same nurse she's playing against, or me, as that would mean I'm currently typing in her chat while mid-blink and mid-chase and still kicking her ass in it, may I add. And she also says that she can't, but she very clearly can as she's still making a big deal about it. That's like me saying I'm lost for words and then reading a 50-page essay off about the subject. But since she thinks it is me typing, let's go see what I was doing during this time. Nice. Okay, that's my fuck up. Nice good ball. I don't really have the grasp of the 20% yet, so I'm probably gonna be missing a lot of simple blinks. I will try though. That was a decent prediction. I didn't think she'd actually take that. This clip is of course a cover-up of me actually pausing time itself to type in her chat because I care so much about a video game. It's always when I don't freaking want it, I swear. I didn't want it, Jet. I was trying to get out. I was literally trying to leave. I'm over it. So by trying to get out of the game, you are essentially doing something called rage quitting. May I remind you this is the same thing that she was going to try to report someone for doing earlier in the game. And while she says that she can't, she is still very clearly going on about the person in her chat who has just delved so deep into her mind, they are living in there rent free. Coming in my chat, typing in my chat, while you're playing the game, I just, I don't need that energy. <laughs> What the fuck? What the fuck? What is that quirky face expression she's trying to use? And when she says she can't deal with that energy, she's literally the one creating said energy. I know you guys love counting things in here. Oh no, I'm on the ground again. Can you type in my chat, sorry I downed you, while you're carrying me? I'd love that. That's like my favorite thing, dude. Since she thinks we love counting things so much, I was gonna try to come up with the number of times that she complained. Or just simply the amount of times that she made a situation out of nothing. Unfortunately, this number was far too complicated for me to calculate, but I currently have a team of scientists working on solving the equation. Times your killer comes in stream to cheat and see where you are and what you're doing. 
it's I just I don't even care if that's what they were or weren't doing but like you're really gonna type in my chat while playing the game sorry somebody disconnected I uh, play the freaking game dude why are you typing to me get out of here like to reiterate, her problem would not be the fact that a killer might stream sniper. Her problem would be that the killer has the sheer audacity to type in her chat while she is playing the video game against them. Oh yeah, also, Mrs. Rage Quitter herself, easy report. I don't understand. I don't understand. Why do you guys always get mad for nothing? Play good? Oh, okay, cool. Bye. Anybody else? I could munch all day, dude. Just like how she can munch all day, she can also pull problems out of her ass all day. Ah, okay. Cool. Understood. Yeah. So that was his viewer who came in to troll. And I'm guessing this guy also came in to talk shit, too. So his chat is coming over to harass me and poorly troll me. That's what it is. That's why the name didn't match. I hate to break it to you, but if this woman thinks that that is harassment, there is a very good chance that she has never been harassed or bullied in her entire life. To sum it up, she thinks that someone coming into her chat saying, good luck, have fun, and then someone saying, hey, you know, why are you making a problem out of nothing? Just get good. That is clearly harassment and should be judged to the highest degree in a court of law. That's what it was. It's harassment. Got it. It's a very uh, toxic community coming over to send harassment. That's what it is. Can you send me um, name and DMs, Misty, so I can ban them as well? Because if their community is going to be toxic, they're not welcome in here either. I could imagine this woman sitting in class and during roll call when the teacher mispronounces her name, her first step would be to call the fucking authorities. Like, she honestly sounds like the type of student who would tattle to the hall monitor over people not having hall passes. Imagine having the time and energy. I don't. Barely have enough energy for myself, dude. That's reportable? Oh! Marcel says that's reportable. Here, Marcel. Let me uh, report their Twitch account. Did you notice how quick she perked up for someone who doesn't have any energy the second she found out she could report someone for her bullshit lie? It's kind of crazy, right? Uh, bullying or harassment? Advocating? Oh, coordinating. Coordinating harassment. Next. Sending your community over is harassment and bullying. Submit report. Block this user. Close. Cool. I reported him. That's right, guys. Sending your community over is harassment and bullying. This just in on Twitch.tv news. Every single person who has ever raided another user on Twitch is getting banned for harassment. I cannot believe you'd ever bring your community into someone else's streams. How dare you? I swear this woman seems like the female version of Toller Toast with the way she acts. I mean, they both love playing the victim. They both love making up lies. And most importantly, they both have an ungodly amount of hours in the game and still suck at playing it. Man, it's just like yesterday all over again. Hi, Scenic. How you doing? Eating too much paste? Dude, I don't know what's wrong. I had people yesterday that also came in harass and bully. Like, I don't know what's in the water lately, but people need to calm down. I promise you, some little Jimmy came into her chat the other day and was like, Hey, GG's, I really enjoyed our match. Um... I'm sorry that the people DC'd, but I had a lot of fun, and hopefully you did too. And her first response was to immediately ban them and play the victim. I don't know. I'm just here to play a video game. <laughs> Y'all better sharpen your hammers. For someone here to just play a video game, you do a lot of complaining that seems to be outside of the game itself, and also, what the fuck do you mean by sharpening your hammer? That's just, it's just not how it works. If you're a streamer and you're like, can someone go say thank you for the game so-and-so? Sure, that's cool, but you have to say don't be a dick to this person. I'm sorry, your chat's not as nice you think they are. No. No. I mean, reported for harassment, so. Alright, so we're just done with. No reason to talk about it. Basically, people in my chat were telling me that she was being a dick about the whole situation, so. As I would with anyone, even if I was friends with them, I told my chat not to be dicks about it. And, uh, apparently that makes my community extremely toxic. But at least it's all over and she's never going to talk about it again, right? Yep. People are just being harassing, that's all. God fucking damn it. Well, you know what? At least hammers still do blunt damage, right? The hammers are sharp, so... And with that comment goes the last of my brain cells, as well as the last of my hope for some of these Twitch partners. I now completely understand why some people are scared to go against streamers or even just scared to get into Twitch in general. 
Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, the reason that this all happened was because I sent one of my viewers to say GG's from the killer, and sorry for the broken add-ons, as sometimes when you talk while you're live in someone else's chat, this can be seen as self-promotion. So while I may have avoided self-promotion, I did not uh, avoid a salty Twitch streamer trying to use the situation to say that I committed coordinated harassment. But yeah, guys, if you subscribe right now, I promise there will be an entire Apache helicopter right outside your door. This is definitely not a scam. Tomorrow morning, there will be an entire helicopter sitting there on your doorstep. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next video.